Oh boy, so this one's going to be a, a tiny bit of a rant here, but I mean, in all, to, to give the trailer its credit, it looks amazing. It looks gorgeous. The story looks massively interesting. But again, I, I know everyone's sort of tired of just hearing the same Destiny rant over and over again. But if anything, this more than provides validity to everybody's rants about this game. Osiris, the character that shows up right there, he shows up right there. And throughout this trailer, we see that he is the most interesting and well thought out and most mysteriously driven character that we have ever seen in Destiny's history. Not Destiny 2 and not Destiny 1. I mean Destiny as an entirety, except for excluding the lore, because there are a few characters in there that can be interesting or more interesting than uh, Osiris here. But the relationship between him and his ghost is, again, just an interesting relationship. This is one of the most, or rather, the most interesting character that we have ever seen in Destiny history, and why can't I be him? Like, throughout the Destiny story, I don't want to be me. I want to be Osiris. I want to go on crazy adventures like he's going on now. These crazy time adventures with the Vex and all that. But, I mean, I want to have the relationship that he has with his ghost. But I can't have that because my ghost, the only thing it does is just talk to me. It just tells me what to do. There's no relationship between us. He just tells me what to do when I do it. There's no arguing back and forth. There's no like Han Solo, Princess Leia type thing that there is here. And I know that's weird to say, but it's just like a, a like a married couple, I guess. A, a man and a woman just arguing back and forth, right? That's really what this is. But they do it in a fun and dynamic way. And again, here, oh, he discovers a secret about the Vex, and then there's this weird, here comes the, the red thing that's circling around that can see their light or whatever. And it's awesome, it's interesting, and I'm so excited, all right? But I know that, that that's not me. I'm going to go on an adventure to find this guy, and it's going to be way less cool than anything we've seen in this trailer. And that that's, that's what I'm just disappointed about. It may not be as cool, but it won't be as interesting as, the, as those two as characters. And that's basically all I had to say. I'm, I mean, I'm going to play it because I already paid like $110 for both of the DLC packs. But, uh, yeah. I mean, it's okay. It looks awesome. But I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.